Okay, my darlings, this is the Biltmore. Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never ran, said a no, man, I still go. Go, 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 go. Good morning, my darlings. It actually is, I don't have my watch on, but it is six something in the morning. I am getting ready to go down to Coral Gables for my birthday brunch. And I was like, you know what? Let me bring you guys with me because I, I don't recall if I've taken you guys to um, Coral Gables. Um, so first let's do the makeup. This is going to be a quick five minute face because of course I got to drop Riley off at school. And so I just want to, she's eating breakfast right now to get everybody situated, take Maverick for a walk and then hit the highway. So I'm putting on my sunscreen, which is going to look really crazy right now. It's going to look white until I put the makeup on. Um, but this is, um, Versed. I've showed you this before. Versed sunscreen that they sent to me they were so kind to send to me and so i'm very careful not to like get it well i got it all in my brow and all in my wig okay so that was a lie i was gonna say i'm very careful to like not get it on my brow or my wig but i did both but you know what i've showed you how to take excess moisture off of the skin and so what we're gonna do is we are just going to put some powder over the brow I'm using Gucci powder, but it does not need to be Gucci powder. This makeup, I want to last all day long, darlings. I'm not, well, not all day until I pick up Riley. So as always, we are going to be using the Anastasia um, brow definer. My husband may be in and out of the room as he's getting ready as well, but this is real life, people. I don't know who's out here putting on their makeup with no just no interruptions, but not in the Dean household. Um, so if you hear the door open, it could be him, it could be Riley. It could be Mavi. All right, so let's just go ahead and do this quick brow. I could do the brush, but when I am in a rush, this is just like simple and easy. And I'm also trying to grow my brows a little bit. So it's just helping me create a more natural brow. I think that's good enough, right? I'm not trying to be perfect. Just trying to get out the house. Mom life, y'all, mom life. All right, so that's one brow done. And then, so let's do this brow. Let's hope that they're similar. <laughs> let's do this brow. And I'm only showing you this because I know some of you are still working on your brow, brow game. So we just do the line here at the, at the bottom and just kind of start in the middle there. Create that arch and fill it in. All right not trying to be perfect all right and then we just want to comb in here a little bit so it lightens it up it gives it a more natural kind of fade does that look okay let's do a little bit more here this is going to be a quick shadow look but it's going to look like it's a million bucks all right um so let's put on the concealer so this is the milk concealer i have been this is my go-to. It's been my go-to. I'm not using anything else right now. And so what I do is I just go ahead and do underneath and carry the excess, carry the excess onto the lid to act as a primer for my eyeshadow. Easy peasy. Being careful not to wipe off the eyebrow that we just put on. <laughs> All right, so easy peasy so i'm trying to decide if i want to do a shimmer or a matte eye i think i'm going to do a matte eye because i want to do a glossy lip i am did i tell you what we're doing in core gables going to brunch i am meeting my mentor slash business coach slash one of my loves um violet de Ayala for brunch and then we are going to go to books and books um, you guys know that I am a nerd. I'm using the Baked Browns um, Dose of Colors palette. So it has all the matte nude color that you would want. So I'm just digging into that. And so we're going to go to Books and Books. You guys know that I'm a nerd. So when she asked what I wanted to do for my birthday, I was like, I want to do a fabulous, beautiful brunch. And then go and like buy a bunch of fashion magazines or books or yeah, that's like the best thing for me. <laughs> Books, magazines, I just like to be around knowledge. So she's a huge book lover as well. 
So she's like, yep, let's do it. All right, so I did the transition shade and I'm just gonna go with this color because it's most like my lid color. And I'm just gonna put that, I use, for those of you who are new, welcome, welcome. I like to use my fingers. It's just easy for me. And I get it right where I want it. So there's that. And then I'm gonna go in the corner with this dark, the darker brown. No interruptions? It's very unlike my family. <laughs> I probably would have had like five interruptions by now. All right, so we wanna wipe the excess down here and then the excess in here. Now for the, for the outer corner, I'm gonna use a different brush. It does come with a brush, but I'm just gonna use this brush. <laughs> Has a little bit of the transition shade in there, but I just wanna give it a little bit of depth. And I may actually use a colored liner. So you see, I just wanna give it a little bit of depth in there, and then I just kinda of wipe the excess. I have some dryness here because your girl was out here eating birthday cake. <laughs> I will take care of that between uh, between takes when I put on, put on my mascara. You know, it's just, you gotta live a little, you know, but I knew my skin was gonna pay for it. All right, so I'm gonna put on, we've talked about this before, and I will leave a link to the Sephora dupe because they don't have this anymore, but I did actually get the Sephora one, but I wanna use this up first. Um, the Marc Jacobs, it's like a wine colored um, uh, eyeliner. And so Sephora does have a dupe and I will leave it um, I find that this just basic black for me is just a little bit too harsh. Um, when I go out tonight, I actually am going out tonight. I might do, this, this might be a two part video. Um, I'll probably do another video for you guys. Um, I'm going out tonight. And so when I go out at night, that's when I use black, but for daytime lunch, a nice wine is nice. All right. So let me put on my mascara and then we'll come back with the rest of the face. All right, guys, so mascara is on. I'm going in with my Chanel Ultra Latent. As you can see, it's like, <laughs> it's what I've been loving on. Guys, I've been using this thing. Oh, Lord, I have a little blemish right here too from, oh God, that doggone cake. <laughs> it was so good going down. No, I just knew it was gonna pay for it. And so I use foundation that I know is going to stay with me all day because I have had people ask like about less expensive makeup and there are some really good less expensive makeup I'm just not up for the trial and error because again I am not updating I always cover my mouth by the way I am not powdering or anything during the day so my when I put on my makeup it has to sit where it is honey that being said, I'm gonna put this powder, this, I don't even know if they sell this anymore, the NARS Overlust um, Cheek Palette. And I love this, as you can see. And so, it's a cheek palette, but I literally just put it all over my face because it just adds a warmth to the face, I find. It adds a warmth that the foundation because, you know, the foundation is going to, like, nullify your face. And so that powder just kind of brings the life back. And then I go in with my Tom Ford in Disclosure. You always want to smile. I don't typically dip back in because there's enough on the brush. It's my birthday. <laughs> my birthday month. Why not? What lip have I been doing? I have been doing the Charlotte Tilbury lip. However, Riley came in here and messed with it. So I'm going to do a liner, the Huda Beauty Lip Contour in Warm Brown. So it's a little messy. Um, I think it's Bitch Perfect is what it's called. Hold on. So I'm going to put that on. I love this brown. I could just wear this to be fair. And I'm gonna kind of color in the lip. And then I'm going to 
Look what Riley did, y'all. Look at that. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Just a little bit of color. It's like the perfect. Oh, I'm spit. Sorry, guys. Perfect nude. And we are good to go. Question of the day Do I want to wear a headband? I've been sporting headbands. I mean, it's my birthday month. Why not? No, I'm not going to wear a headband because where did I put it? I might want to use, not use, I'm thinking about wearing. If you follow me on Instagram, then you saw this beautiful padlock necklace from Season to Consign. I will leave a link to their wonderful website and Instagram. If you're not following them, following them on Instagram, you are missing out. But they gifted this for me. I went to their um, friend's giving event and um, they gifted this to me. And so it's a Vuitton. Did I even show you what it is? Vuitton padlock necklace. Right. Yes. Necklace. So I wore this for New Year's and I'm thinking about wearing it ooh, today. And so this and this, I think will just, that's to me, to me, that's too much. I don't wear a lot anyway, but, um, cause I was going to wear my Hermes, um, click H, but I think I'm just going to go very like subtle. So I'm going to get Riley finished and then I'm going to show you my outfit. It's in between. Actually, let me show you the two shoes that I'm thinking about. Let's do that. And then I'll show you the rest of my outfit and my bag. <laughs> all right, excuse the mess. <laughs> my Givenchy's are too big for this, but um, all right. So because I'm doing such a busy dress, I really, well, it's either, sorry for the shadow, guys. It's either between these Givenchy um, little um, flats. I could wear these. I know you like the same thing. No, they're not the same thing. I'm wearing a lot of florals, so I don't want to go here. I'm really thinking about either going here, here, or remember these that I thrifted. Where did I thrift these from? Goodwill in Miami. They were eight bucks. Um, I think this would be cute, right? Because I'm wearing this huge gold necklace so let's see which one should i do i'm veering towards this but we are going to be doing a lot of walking and driving i don't know i'm going to try it on in the mirror you guys will see at the end what i chose okay so this is the biltmore in coral gables i want to say this is one of the oldest golf clubs, hotels in Miami. Do not ask me the history. Violet knows. <laughs> I do not. It looks like they're setting up something in the courtyard. You guys know I'm going to take a picture right in there. But, uh, let's go inside. Oh my gosh, guys. There are so many photo opportunities in here. Let me see if I can take a picture of the um, pool. Hold on. There's people coming. to show you my outfit so the dress is um by dia and co they gifted to gifted it to me this summer um and i think i've worn it in a vlog i'm not sure um the bag is dior the shoes i went with the um Givenchy because it has the silver that goes with the chain and um yeah ready for brunch let's go so the question is do i want to take a picture here I want to take a picture there. There are people behind me, so I don't want to get them on, on film. Hold on. Do I want to take a picture here? Oh, so many options. <laughs> Look at this pool area. I don't want to get anybody in that shot, but I just want to show you just how stunning it is. Even the geese are having fun. <laughs> I got some city gifts. And let me show you something. Let me show you the most bougie thing that Ms. Ronda misses from the Daniela and Who does that? Who has ribbons made? Like what? 
but it's, I can't wait to open it. Should I open it for you guys? No, we're gonna have our moment. I'll show you, show you what happens after. So look who got a clean copy of the new book. I'm gonna leave a link to it um, in the description box, but listen, everything I know about money and manifestation and getting my money mindset together, I learned from her. <laughs> and she's put it all in this book, so oh my gosh. We're gonna go through this, guys. And you're gonna give me the link so that they can join the, the 30 day? Yes, the 30 day March series. Okay, and then look at this. <laughs> Look what we created. Isn't it chic and lovely? I'm going to leave a link to Fun City so that you guys oh, can join. Thank you. Oh, all right. Time to get to breakfast. Oh, Wakanda forever. Laura or she can't tell me she doesn't know somebody just asked her to make this call. I never ran sitting on man, I still go, go, go.